Prepare to be astounded as we unravel the engineering marvel that has left Europe in awe. We will see China's groundbreaking feat, the impossible 10,000-kilometer pipeline. Witness the audacity and ingenuity behind this colossal infrastructure project that has sent shockwaves throughout Europe. From its mind-boggling scale to the geopolitical implications, join us as we uncover the secrets, challenges, and the jaw-dropping impact of this pipeline on the world stage. You won't believe what China has achieved. European nations' decision to end cooperation with Turkmenistan came as a shock and dealt a devastating blow to Turkmenistan's hopes for energy partnerships. Europe had relied heavily on Turkmenistan for supplies but abruptly switched focus favoring Azerbaijan instead and leaving Turkmenistan's vast natural gas reserves untapped despite long-standing dependence. Unfortunately, no explanation for their actions have ever been offered publicly. However, China saw this turn of events as a unique chance and has since signed an agreement to build a 10,000-kilometer natural gas pipeline along its southern coastline. This dramatic alteration in alliance has fundamentally altered energy dynamics throughout this region. China took advantage of European nations' withdrawal of cooperation with Turkmenistan to come to an agreement with this Central Asian nation. Recognizing Turkmenistan's abundant natural gas reserves. They provided an $8 billion loan that supported exploration and infrastructure development activities there, together with embarking on construction of a 10,000-kilometer natural gas pipeline, which allowed Turkmenistan to export 37 billion cubic meters per annum for China's growing energy needs. Not only economically beneficial to Turkmenistan, but also solidifying strategic advantages within their relationship and strategic advantage within the regional partnership. Turkmenistan boasts one of the world's largest natural gas reserves, estimated between 750 billion cubic meters and 900 billion cubic meters, valued at roughly $270 billion, but faces significant economic hurdles. Turkmenistan's economic struggles due to limited capital and technology for large-scale natural gas development projects, with only an estimated gross domestic product GDP, of $25 billion. Turkmenistan sought foreign investment and technical cooperation with European nations in an attempt to expand its natural gas sector and form long-term energy partnerships. But these partners instead prioritize Azerbaijan instead, consequently leaving Turkmenistan's resources underutilized and forcing it to turn towards alternative partners like China for the development of its industry. Turkmenistan has made efforts to secure both foreign investments and technical cooperations to bolster its natural gas sector. Realizing both capital requirements as well as advanced technology advances are vital components to expanding reserves while forging long-term energy partnerships. Turkmenistan attempted to collaborate with European nations, hoping that their expertise and investment capabilities could benefit Turkmenistan. Unfortunately, European states shifted their attention elsewhere instead. Even with Turkmenistan's rich natural gas resources, Turkmenistan did not waver from their determination and turned instead towards other partners, particularly China, with whom it established loans and cooperative agreements, hoping to attract investment and technical cooperation to further advance its natural gas sector and enhance economic prospects. Europe's unexpected shift of cooperation from Turkmenistan to Azerbaijan had a devastating effect on Turkmenistan's aspirations for energy partnerships. While Turkmenistan had anticipated stable energy partnerships with European nations, Europe quickly diverted resources towards Azerbaijan Azerbaijan's natural gas exploration project instead. This drastic decision dealt a severe blow to Turkmenistan as their natural gas resources went unsung and the anticipated collaboration slipped away quickly. Furthermore, Europe demonstrated their shifting priorities and strategic considerations, leaving Turkmenistan struggling in pursuit of economic development with no partner who could supply markets or energy partnerships that could support economic development efforts in general. China has emerged as a key global consumer of natural gas, home to an estimated population of 1.4 billion, and with its economy rapidly expanding, energy demand in China has skyrocketed. Projected consumption levels by 2022 should exceed 330 billion cubic meters, or 15% of the world total consumption. Recognizing the need to ensure reliable supply, China actively pursues gas resources from various regions. This consumption prompting China signing agreements of partnerships with gas-rich nations, such as Turkmenistan, in an attempt to ensure stable supplies of energy resources for their growing economies while simultaneously changing global energy dynamics. China has provided Turkmenistan's natural gas exploration efforts a crucial boost with an $8 billion loan, lending funds that were instrumental in improving exploration, extraction, and transport capabilities of natural gas resources. 
Not only has China provided relief to capital constraints in Turkmenistan, but their financial support has enabled Turkmenistan to diversify export markets while lessening reliance on single markets. Further evidence that their commitment is strengthening energy cooperation while simultaneously creating mutual economic advantages between both nations. Building the 10,000 km natural gas pipeline between China and Turkmenistan was an extraordinary effort intended to connect Turkmenistan's abundant gas reserves to China's growing energy needs. This pipeline comprises four main lines running across Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan, Kazakhstan, and China. Construction of this extensive pipeline network aims not only at expedient transportation of Turkmenistan's abundant natural gas reserves, but also enhances energy interconnection and cooperation among participating nations. Together, this effort could reshape energy supply patterns throughout the region while reaping substantial economic and energy advantages for China as well as Turkmenistan. Central Asia Natural Gas Pipeline holds immense significance to both the surrounding countries and to Central Asia itself. Consisting of an expansive network spanning thousands of kilometers, the project provides transport of natural gas from Central Asia directly into key consumption centers, most importantly China. Turkmenistan benefits from diversification in export options while decreasing dependence on Russia as its trading partner. China views it as a vital energy supply source that reduces dependence on other nations for energy delivery. Furthermore, the Central Asia Natural Gas Pipeline serves to strengthen regional economic cooperation, create employment opportunities, and strengthen energy security, playing an integral part in changing energy dynamics, encouraging economic development, and strengthening regional cooperation. Turkmenistan has held high hopes for energy cooperation cooperation between European nations as it works to capitalize on its abundant natural gas reserves. Aiming to develop more gas production, Turkmenistan hoped to form stable partnerships aimed at expanding gas development, recognizing Europe's long-standing dependence on multiple suppliers for gas supplies. Its hopes were dashed when European states instead prioritized Azerbaijan, leaving Turkmenistan's resources underutilized and leading them back towards partnership negotiations with Azerbaijan instead. Nonetheless, Turkmenistan still yearns for cooperation as it seeks market access as well as creating relationships aimed at mutual economic gain between European nations while opening up trade deals mutually beneficial economic agreements. Central Asia Natural Gas Pipeline has made an immense impactful statement about energy in Central Asia, connecting Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan, and Kazakhstan's vast gas reserves to China through this conduit. It has opened new paths for exporting and diversification, heavily dependent upon traditional energy routes for transporting energy across Central Asia. This project now establishes direct connections between that market and Central Asia. This shift has not only enhanced energy security for its participating nations, but it has also promoted economic development, created job openings, and fostered regional cooperation. Central Asia's natural gas pipeline has revolutionized regional energy dynamics, bringing long-term benefits for all parties involved. The Central Asia Natural Gas Pipeline Project is an ambitious infrastructure endeavor intended to connect gas-rich countries in Central Asia to energy-consuming regions, principally China, by way of pipeline. The project includes four main lines, Line A traversing Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan, and Turkmenistan, Line B running through Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan, C line linking Uzbekistan with Afghanistan and Pakistan, and finally Line D connecting Kazakhstan to Western China. With an approximate total length of 10,000 kilometers, this pipeline network plays a pivotal role in diversifying energy supply sources, supporting regional economic cooperation initiatives, and efficiently transporting natural gas resources. This project holds immense economic and strategic importance both to Central Asian nations as well as China. The suspension of Line D in the Central Asian Natural Gas Pipeline project has caused great alarm. Intended to connect Kazakhstan and Western China, its construction represents an essential segment. Delays have created uncertainties for Turkmenistan due to disruptions to energy supplies and transportation networks within its borders, while also raising questions over timeline completion timeline. Impact on natural gas exports from Turkmenistan, stability issues associated with the pipeline, etc. Therefore, resumption is important in order for success of Central Asia Natural Gas Pipeline project overall. Turkmenistan's visit to China marked an essential step toward ending the construction halt on Line D of Central Asia's natural gas pipeline. Turkmenistan's president held talks with Chinese officials to address their concerns and explore possible resumption options for the project, raising high hopes that progress and work could resume with immediate effect. The meeting held high anticipation that progress and work might resume shortly afterwards. Turkmenistan and China pledged their joint dedication to working closely together to overcome any potential hurdles to the timely completion of Line D project, underlying both nations' determination for ongoing energy cooperation between their two nations.
This visit demonstrates its significance while showing mutual interest for ongoing energy cooperation between Turkmenistan and China. Turkmenistan has seen immense economic and energy benefits from the Central Asia gas pipeline. Through it, Turkmenistan can transport its abundant natural gas resources efficiently to Asian markets such as China. This has resulted in significant natural gas exports increasing significantly while creating substantial income from export income generated. Furthermore, diversifying energy export options away from Russia reduced dependence. Domestic economic development saw vitality restored into the economy through Central Asia's gas pipeline sustainable partnership between two energy partners, as well as providing sustainability of Turkmenistan's energy exports. Central Asia's gas pipeline plays a crucial role in expanding and diversifying Turkmenistan's natural gas exports. Turkmenistan and China both experience rapid energy market development, therefore connecting Turkmenistan's abundant natural gas resources directly with them provides a valuable and cost-efficient means of export. Turkmenistan has greatly expanded and diversified their export capacity as a result, opening new markets while mitigating risks by diversifying export destinations and increasing stability within energy exports. Overall, the pipeline has enabled expansion and diversification of natural gas exports from Turkmenistan, as well as economic development prospects that could open new opportunities. Turkmenistan has found great benefit in diversifying its gas export routes since Russia became its primary market, which significantly lessened their dependency and risks associated with sold market dependence. Furthermore, having greater control of natural gas exports enhanced energy security and independence of Turkmenistan. Turkmenistan has found an effective means of repaying its loan using natural gas resources. China provided Turkmenistan with an $8 billion loan. As part of this arrangement, natural gas exports from Turkmenistan were used to pay back this obligation directly tied to Turkmenistan's gas reserves and strengthen economic ties between both nations, as well as providing long-term sustainability of loan replacement plans. Construction of the Central Asia Gas Pipeline has played a crucial role in strengthening energy cooperation between China and Turkmenistan. China has provided Turkmenistan with financial support of $8 billion through a loan that has allowed it to develop its natural gas industry industry and infrastructure, strengthening both energy cooperation and economic ties between the two nations. China has played a central role in Turkmenistan's energy industry by providing reliable markets and investments. Their natural gas resources help meet China's rising energy requirements. This mutual cooperation between both nations in energy matters has only strengthened over time. China has gained significant strategic advantage over the construction of the Central Asia gas pipeline and reduced its dependence on other nations for natural gas supply. By connecting directly to Turkmenistan's abundant gas resources via this direct and secure pipeline route, they now enjoy less exposure of geopolitical risks or fluctuations in global markets, and increased energy security thanks to an uninterrupted source of natural gas supply able to meet China's rising energy demands, while strengthening China as an integral partner within regional energy landscape and decreasing reliance on external suppliers. Thank you for watching, and please do not forget to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up.